either sympathize or criticize. Tinibu, Simon Ekwa drops another bombshell about President for heavily see the details. Good morning everyone and thank you for tuning in and listening to this headline that we got to end this morning. Or uh, our headline for this morning says here, it's either you sympathize or criticize Tinibu. Simon Ekwa drops another bombshell after Tinibu falls heavily see the details. Well, in a surprising twist, Nigeria's social media has been buzzing with reaction to an unexpected incident involving the president of Nigeria, President Bola Ahmed Tinibu. On the recent outing, Tinibu expressed a minor fall, sparking a wave of commentary and speculation online. However, one notable reaction from the Simon Epa, a prominent Nigerian political activist known for his outspoken views, taken to Twitter, Epa expressed his surprise that no one had blamed him for Tinibu's fall. He tweeted, I am still in shock that no one has accused Samanepa of being responsible for Tinibu falling today. This comment highlights the often contentious and blame fouled na- nature of Nigerian political discourse, where people public figure frequently becomes target of conspiracy theories and unfounded accusation. Well, Samanepa's remarks underscores a broader trend in Nigeria politics where leaders and activists alike are quick to be to blamed for incidents beyond their control. Well, this phenomenon is not unique to Nigeria, but is particularly pronounced in the country's high-polarized um, political environment. The fall of the president, Boris Mbola Metinbu, eminent minor, has become a symbol of the intense scrutiny and rapid uh, dissemination of information and misinformation, characteristics of the contemporary political life in Nigeria. President Tinbu, a seasoned politician with a significant following, has often been the subject of public and media attention. His fall captured on video was quickly shared across various platforms, prompting a mix of concern and humor from the public. While the incident itself was unconsensual, the reaction is the reaction the reaction is generated revealed much about the current state of Nigerian politics. Well, Ekwa's tweet also serves as a reminder of the need for a more measured and responsible approach to political commentary. In an era where social media can amplify voices and spread information rapidly, it is crucial to dis- distinguish between genuine critic and baseless accusation. As Nigeria continues to navigate its complex political landscape, figures like Simon Epa highlight the importance of, politi- of critical thinking and the impact of public discourse on the nation's democratic process. And that is all we have for you guys concerning this headline today this morning, which says here that is either you sympathize or criticize Tinibu. Samuel Epa drops another bombshell after President falls heavily. See the details. Well, you have it for me this morning. And if you're not a subscriber, the best you can do right here right now is to tap that subscribe button, hit the notification bell, leave a like on the video to get more updates concerning this in the next future to come. Well, it's either you criticize or you sympathize with Tinibu. According to what Samanepa said right here, because Samanepa was surprised that when Tinibu fell, nobody came and meet him say Samanepa is the one who involved in Tinibu's falling down. Like, you know, that like, they always blame him for every little thing that happened. Like, any little thing that happens in the South, it'll be like Samanepa, Samanepa, Samanepa do this, Samanepa do that, Samanepa do this. And Samanepa took this official Twitter account and said that, ah, why have nobody come and meet him say it's him that makes Tinibu fall down? That is very suspicious. And to me, it's very, very funny because a lot of people are laughing. On, a lot of people are just laughing on Twitter. Like, it's true now. Because every little thing they call me to say, it is you that do this, it is you that do this, it is you that do this. Yes. Didn't we just experience a minor fall that day? It was nothing really serious. But someone was like, nobody have come to this DMO and they say, now nah, you do this, now nah, you do this. Hmm. Well, this comment of Samuel Epa highlights the often contentious and blame filled nature of Nigerian political discourse. It is that public figures frequently become targets of conspiracy theories, founded accusation. It's true. When something like this happens to politicians, they quickly find quickly find public figures to blame. Yes. Well, it's not it's not his fault. Activists are are quick to be blamed concerning anything that happens in Nigerian politics, like the protests now. That there was not the end back of that protest. The protest have never even started. Why are they blaming um, Samanekpa and Peter Obi? Does that make sense?
Yeah, some of the people that was not even part of protest at all. They're not, they're not even saying anything concerning protest. Say that it is some of the people that start that that is feeling that protest. It is Peter Peter that is feeling that protest. All this, yeah, and some of the people was surprised that nobody come to him and say, say okay, the the it is some of the people that made Tinubu fall like like they normally do. Yes, if Tinubu sleeps, they will say it's him. If, if this don't happen, they will say it's him. They say so. It is it, it, like seriously. Yeah, I think you understand what I'm saying right here, right now. Well, what can, what what can we say concerning all this? Because the president, a seasoned politician with a significant following, well, he has been a subject of public and media attention, and that is what I was captured on video, quickly went viral across all social media platform. With a lot of people telling him sorry, a lot of people laughing about it. No, you, know, you know Nigerians are the way we are. Your your president for it's a way to. Came, keep calm, and a lot of people are just laughing about it on the internet, saying this, saying that, saying this. Even some of the himself was laughing, laughing. Well, one thing is for sure, we all know that some of is not fans with the federal government at all, due to his uh, uh, agitating for his, for his sovereign state of Brafia. To you, you, you just understand, it's, it's not really, it, it's not fans with the federal government at all in any which way. But what can we all say concerning this? Drop a comment in the comment section. Don't forget to leave a like on this video. Or you can tap the subscribe button and be good on with the notification bell. So anytime I have any new video, you'll be the first to get notified about it. Once again, thank you for tuning in and have a wonderful day ahead of you.